Hi my little friends, it's Miss Jalen and welcome back to another craft video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make a paper plate menorah. The things you're going to need is your paper plates, scissors, we're linking our candles for you to print out with our video, glue or tape, markers or any color marker you want, I'm using red. And if you want any type of string, I'm using this. Okay, the first step to do is to print out your candles and cut those out. I already went ahead and cut my candles out, so they should look like this, like individual candles when you already have them cut out. The next step that we're going to do is grab our paper plate and we're going to fold it in half. Once you have it folded in half, you're going to cut that. It should look just like this. You don't want to flatten it out if you're using the plates. You want to kind of flatten it out. It should look just like this. If you haven't gone ahead and cut your candles out, do that right now and pause this video. If you already have, let's go on to our next step. So now we're going to grab our glue and we're going to glue around the top right here. If you don't want to use glue, you can also use tape to hold your candles down. Now in a menorah, a menorah has nine candles. So the candle in the middle is always the one that is the longest one. So we're gonna put our first candle right in the middle of our plate. It should look just like that. Now you're gonna put four on this side, four on this side, right below here for the end of this of the square boxes right there four on each side that is where your flame the top of the candle before the flame should be hitting one three, four. I just did one side, see, four. And now we're going to do the other side. And remember, you can be unique. You can put the colors whichever way you want. And if you don't want to use colors, just print out your the paper in black and white. Okay, once those are all done, it should look something like this. So now we're going to go ahead and make sure that you're middle. Now we're going to go ahead and draw in front of our menorah. So each candle should somewhat connect to the other, just like this.
And remember, you can design color to anything you want down here. Make it as unique as you want. You don't have to follow my instructions exactly. Now, you are done with all that. You can grab your string. Grab some string. Some ribbon that you can use anything you want. And we are going to glue that or tape it in the back to each side just like this so that you are able to hang this somewhere if you'd like. I'm actually going to use some tape. So when you're all done, your menorah should look something like this. I hope you enjoyed making this quick craft with me. Bye, my little friends.